Hey y'all, hey, Amanda here, and today I'm filming my Black Friday Paula's Choice haul. This stuff came in like two days. It was insane. So, very impressed with the quick shipping. Always impressed with Paula's Choice. I'm pretty much a fanatic. I think there's a, a link in the description box below, like a referral type link. They give it to like everybody who signs up for the website, the like a Paula's Choice account. But I think if it's your first time purchasing, you get $10 off and then I get a $10 credit? I think. And also Paula's Choice is on Ebates. I also have an Ebates sign up link. I'm not sure what the gimmick on that one is, but I know I get some sort of reward if people sign up. But also, once again, that's a standardized reward that anyone who signs up gets. So, if you're interested in signing up, go right ahead. If not, don't worry about it. And let's get to the haul. So I am fresh out the shower and I figured what better time to film a skincare haul. And I'm in my coffee and donut pajamas, which are super comfy. And these are from Target last year. I haven't seen them there this year, but I've been trying to stay away from Target and be a good girl. Now let's get started on this haul. So there are actually a few things I've been needing. And then some of these things are just, just cause purchases. <laughs> So, the first thing I bought was the Calm Redness Relief Toner for Normal to Oily Skin. I just stocked up on a toner because I always go through toner. I go through it the quickest of any of the products I use because I use it like every day, twice a day. So, just picked up one of those. Uh, I don't necessarily stick to a particular toner from Paula's Choice. I just make sure I'm using one of her toners. And then also from that same line, I got the SPF Mineral, Mineral, Mineral Moisturizer, so also from the Calm Redness Relief from Normal to Dry Skin. Even though my skin tends to get kind of shiny over the course of the day, I always get products made for drier skin because I find that my skin just soaks things in. Like, it gets dehydrated, I suppose. It doesn't get dry, but kind of dehydrated. So, got this. And I hacked, I actually did have, from the Resist line, a SPF product tinted moisturizer that was for dry, or not dry, um, normal to oily skin, and I hated it. It was just like dry, desert wasteland of a face. So, excited to be using that again. Well, not using it again, but using an SPF, because I was going without one for a little bit there. And then, once again, my obsession with moisture. I got the Resist Intensive Repair Cream for dry to very dry skin. It has retinol in it. And this is the cute little bottle. It's just so stumpy and cute. And I'm going to actually be putting some of this on right now, because I used the Weekly Resurfacing Treatment and didn't have anything super moisturizing to put on after that. So, I actually have my mirror right here next to me. Oh god, I'm so blind. Are, do any of you wear glasses and like when you take them off, you realize, damn, I can't see shit. Oh, I need to get new um, cotton rounds because I always feel little cotton like beads, not beads, but like where the cotton comes off and then balls up when you're like rubbing stuff on yourself. So, I might be kind of shiny now, but I promise you I feel ten times better than I did two seconds ago. So now that that's taken care of, oh, that feels really nice. It's very silky. Okay, so this is a product, and I'm not even going to lie, I don't know what it does. I just saw it on the front page, and that it was new, and I'm like, oh, I want it. So it is the Resist Brightening Essence for all skin types. Um, directions apply two to three drops onto face and neck for optimal results. Use in the AM and PM for daytime, always follow sunscreen. Um, restores radiance for a healthy glow. So it seems this is just another moisturizing, brightening, balancing product. 
and it sounds like it's probably in a dropper. Yeah, so here's what it looks like. It's really cool, and I guess this is probably a pump drop. Of course, my hands are like slimy now. Not slimy, but... Okay, well, I can't open it because my hands are all moisturizy right now. But y'all get how it works. Cool. Next is a duo. I bought these together. I think it's like five, you save five dollars if you buy them in one of the bundles, so I did that. This is a product I've had before. I think this is the one I've had before. Um, oh, oh, yes, I think it is. Just slid everywhere. This is the Skin Balancing Super Antioxidant Concentrate Serum for Normal Oily Combination Skin with Retinol. I just like kind of cycling through different ones of these little serums because they're all really good. So I happened to get this one this time. And then I also, in that bundle, got the Resist C15 Super Booster for all skin types, which is the 15% vitamin C serum. And me personally, whenever I use this, oh, oh my, oh my god, where is it? The dropper separate in the box. I usually like to use it on its own. I haven't done a lot of research about Okay, go in there. Jeez. About what products can combine with vitamin C effectively. But I'm going to do that this time because I, I usually would like have one day. Well, I use it in the evening where I'd tone. And this would be like my big bang shabam. And then I'd use moisturizer. So I need to figure out like what actually combines with this well. So I'm not, I don't like make a dangerous concoction. You know? Anyway, I really like this stuff. When I was using it, I just had a sample size. I did notice um, some significant... Well, this is a birthmark and a giant pimple. But right here, I've got a brown... Oh, I'm not even in the screen. This is my birthmark. Right here, I've got a little brown spot. And last time I was using it, I was using that spot as like my control group or whatever to see if something would actually happen and I'd really keep a good focus on that. And I definitely saw some significant reducing of the pigmentation, which was nice. And the next item, and I think, I want to say I had a coupon code of some sort that got me this for free. This is the Resist Anti-Aging Eye Cream with Shea Butter and Peptides. I've said it once, I'll say it again, I'm not a huge fan of like the whole idea of eye creams. If you really need one, go for it. But I'm using like such moisturizing things on my whole face all the time that I'm not sure an eye cream is going to do anything. But if there were to be one that would do something for me, it would probably be the Paula's Choice one. So I'll give it a try. I'll give it a fair shot. And we'll see what happens. But much like with all eye creams, I don't want to be pessimist, but I'm really not expecting much. So that's everything I purchased and used the coupon code to get. And now to go over my free samples, because if you didn't know, you can get three free samples with every Paula's Choice purchase. So the three I chose, I got two body products and one hair product. I got the Smooth Finish Conditioner for all hair types. My hair is really picky. This is probably definitely not enough product from my hair to condition it, but I just wanted to kind of try it, feel the texture, and see what it was like. It's a really pretty color packet it comes into. Then the two body products are from, both from the Resist line, the Weightless Body Treatment 2% BHA for all skin types, which has salicylic acid and antioxidants in it, and then the Skin Revealing Body Lotion 10% AHA for all skin types that has glycolic acid and antioxidants in it. And I've heard, sorry, my face is now slippery so my glasses are falling off. I've heard really good things about both of these so I'm excited to try them. And that is everything that I got in my Black Friday Paula's Choice haul. I hope you enjoyed this video and um, much like when anyone comments to me about Paula's Choice stuff, I'm going to link below a really informative, helpful video 
from Allura Beauty. If you don't follow her um, here on YouTube, if you're not subscribed to her, I highly suggest you subscribe to her. She, in my opinion, is the best beauty YouTuber, personally. I mean, not if you're looking for, like, makeup looks, but, like, if you want the hard facts and, like, rationalized reasons for why something is good or bad, she is the one to go to. And not to mention her voice is very calming. It's very strange. It's not strange. It's just like very calming. I, don't, I find her voice calming. So I will link the video in the description box below where she basically tears through the entire Paul's Choice line, almost the entire Paul's Choice line, and gives you like an in-depth review of every product and even the ones that she doesn't like she goes into. So that will be linked below if you're curious to know more about the products. Also, Paula's Choice does a pretty good job of keeping a ton of information on their own website, so definitely check that out. I will have the referral link below if you are interested, and otherwise, I will talk to you all later. If you enjoyed the video, you can get a thumbs up. If you'd like to stick around for a while, you can hit that subscribe button. Be on the lookout for an updated living room video and a look at my Christmas tree video, which I would have the lights on normally, but it like messes up the, I don't know, it makes a weird look on the screen when I film like that. And then I should have an Old Navy haul coming too soon. So keep an eye out for those videos and my next planner video, and I'll talk to you all later. Bye!